the peak pinnacle of Yu-Gi-Oh gameplay. One duelist versus another duelist. Who can take down and be victorious in that game? Provided that they are non-humans. Yep, we have the bot tournament. We have a basic, standard, good old, regular 2022 July format Yu-Gi-Oh! duel. Featuring nothing but the simple meta that is now. We've got Branded Eldlich, Marine Cess, Dragon, Sword Soul, Sun Avalon, bunch of Punk Synchro, throwing in a couple of random rogue things like BA and uh, Virtual World as well. Who will be victorious? <laughs> Let's check it out. Today is the bot tournament and brought to you by... NordVPN, yes, that is right. If you go on over to nordvpn.com forward slash farfa VPN, you can download at a massively discounted price using my link and code in the description below. And therefore, you will be protected against all of these Mr. Destructoids that are about to take down this duel. Let's get into the gameplay, ladies and gentlemen. And we're off with duel number one. Marine Cess versus Branded Eldlich. So let's see how good this bot is will be uh, at comboing with Marine Cess. I can't imagine it being too, too great. I'm gonna start with the black summoning. <laughs> Giga Chad. <laughs> Mines himself. Okay, all right. Do you think that this is even that bad to be fair? I mean, realistically, I don't know. All right, Spring Girl, Judgment the Normal Summon. I mean, that's correct, probably, right? I think you probably just hit the first Normal Summon against this deck. They're gonna go Blue Slug, but then we don't have any monsters. Oh, non-activated effect of Blue Slug, uh, sorry, of uh, Seahorse to Special into Splash Mage, but Special Summon back, okay, uh-huh, almost there. <gasps> Crystal Heart Pass, no, almost there. Well, at least we outed the mine. Okay, here we go. Terraforming, he's gonna do it again. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's gonna do it again. <laughs> this is so bad. Okay, Crystal Heart protects from battle by uh, negate uh, by discarding a Marine Cess or something, right? All right, and then mine dies. Conk pops his own Gozen match. Okay, sure. Demise of land, attack, all right, 25, big. All right, I think Elder just finally got the upper hand here. It looks like Marine Cess doesn't know how to do a combo. All right, we're gonna dive into horse here. <laughs> Dude, he's obsessed with mine! <laughs> it's a problem card! All right, we got seahorse into angel. All right, we're making plays here. Battle ocean, anemone, equipping, 4,000 anemone, let's go! Into another anemone. You almost had it, you, you almost had it. Oh no. And there goes the third and final Mystic Mine. Okay, here we go. Sanguine for Bailadroach. Oh, that's not good. All right, takes out the Anemone. Anemone puts back Sea Angel instead of adding back a starter to the hand. And draws for turn. That's a Pascalus, which uh, is going to be chained. Uh, we're just going to use Skill Drain in the draw phase. Okay, asserting dominance. And looks like that's going to be it, unless we do something really bad here. Branded Fusion into Albion. How bad can this be? Yeah, it's negated. Never mind. White Destiny. Summon another Eldritch. Oh, look at that board, baby. Look at that board. I don't know how you could ever think Marine Cess piloted by a bot could be could could win this. I really I don't know how you think that could happen. Dragons and Sword Soul. I think Sword Soul is probably the better bot deck, shall we say? This is my build, by the way. Smile. We're gonna go Shatana into Te into uh, the Monk. That's probably incorrect. Uh, we're gonna go Ashuna into Lina. Normal Moi into Nibir. Normal Moi with no token in hand, by the way. <laughs> Ashuna, special summon Adara, make Monk, add back Ashuna. Okay, I mean, you've got some follow up somehow. I mean, th this somehow didn't end up being terrible for you, I guess. All right, let's see. Dargans, what have you got? Dragon Ravine, pitch Foxy Chun. Oh, you didn't Dragon Ravine pitch at all. You were just resolving Foxy Chun. Okay, right. So we're foxy tuning into Ziamen. All right, Ziamen adds Deer Note. Okay, uh, pitching the Deer Note, milling into Hulk, uh, summoning Ash Blossom, Unicorn. Here it is. Spits the token, not itself. Oh boy, let's go. Okay, pops the Monk, uh, which then triggers the Shatana to pop the Unicorn. Now we're on to zero cards here. Okay, we're using a Shuna from the hand for Adara. Vishuda bounce the Dragon Ravine. Amazing, great play. Uh, Shatana bring back Monk. Okay, so we're just playing 10 control. This isn't really a Sword Soul deck. 
I, there it is. Yeah, just summon some tennies, I, I, I suppose. It's, it, it works. Okay, dragons are going to top deck. e -telly! <laughs> It's not the target, my friend. That's not, that's not the target. That's not the target. All right, yeah, that's gonna wrap it up. Oh no, 200 off, actually. All right, we get one more turn. What can we possibly draw? Call by the grave, how unfortunate. Oh, okay, we discard. All right, are we gonna send Absoluter? No, we're gonna dump White Dragon of all cards and just pass. Great, <laughs> amazing. <laughs> Finally gonna put a Sword Soul card on the field and that's gonna be game. Plunder versus Salomon Great. That's a crazy good hand from Salad. Don't know about this Flunder hand though. All right, we're gonna just stand by Shifter. Pot of Prosperity. Only for three. Okay, adds Duality instead of the, um, the Robina. And then we're gonna add Map. Hmm. I think you had the combo pieces there, my friend. Yep, I'm pretty sure you had the combo pieces there. Okay. Uh, what did we circle for? Circled for something. We're gonna go Buffalo <laughs> Lingaribo. <laughs> don't wanna lose the trap cards, bro. <laughs> I don't wanna lose the trap cards. <laughs> Alright, here's another prosperity here. Lingaribo pass. Okay, fantastic. Okay, we're going for six now. I think the AI is getting desperate. It's realized he's brick, so he needs to pop off here. Uh, so we've got map here banishing the spell. That's not how that works. Eglin, chain feathers. <laughs> what the? F I, I, just, I don't have any words for this. I, okay, sure. Oh, uh, you really wanted to resolve that feather storm, huh? Mining pitch jaguar. That seems correct. What? How? How? That set. Uh <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh my god. What? <laughs> I know that this deck is supposed to tribute summon, but come on. <laughs> Parallel exceed triggers in the hand here. Almorage to protect. Trigger gazelle. Holy crap, that's insane. Combos. Dump circle. Spinny to boost. Special spinny. Splash mage. Bring back jaguar. Access code! It's doing things! It's banished itself! Oh no! <laughs> so close! Jaguar, Sanctuary, Relink, Balinx, Make Sunlight Wolf, Normal Buffalo, Summon Transcode Talker, Draw 2, Bring Max Blast Mage, Heat Soul! Oh baby, it's popping off! Let's go! <laughs> this is crazy! No! <laughs> No! How? <laughs> and he's gaining life instead of attacking with the damage. Not like this, man. Not like this. Oh no! <laughs> the storm went bigger than the wolf. How? <laughs> Please. Okay, here we go. 800 damage. We're slowly getting there. Jaguar recycle. We got double Jaguar triggering, adding back Ash Blossom. Big attack position <laughs> because. <laughs> Oh god, what are you doing? Keep summoning and specialing and linking. Okay, all right, we've got a board here. Uh, we've got the spell, which is gonna be Ashed, which we've got called by for. Okay, big gameplay here. Adding Robina. Time to combo. No! <laughs> we were almost there. <laughs> we're just so close. Oh no, not like this. <laughs> I thought Flunder would be an easy shoe-in for this, I'm not gonna lie, okay. Uh, Uncharted wins, mulligans into- yep, okay. So that's game on board, but we've seen the AI, you know. Let's see if he can, like, finish this off here. Don't wanna link away his whole board into a unicorn, potentially. <laughs> Tribute summon Nibiru. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, beautiful. Wow, I thought Flunder was a shoo-in, but what can I say? I guess infinite special summoning and tribute summoning Nibiru was the way to go. Next duel, we've got Phantom Knights versus Despia. I think this was one of the lists that topped Hartford. He was playing Keeper of Dragon Magic, which is a bit strange, but eh, just a random YCS topping list here. 
Not that the list and the intricacies are going to really matter in a bot tournament. So we got Prosperity. We're going to add the Keeper of the Dragon Magic. And we're going to set Cobra. <laughs> okay. Aramisia. We got the token for Fateful. All right. So far, so good. It's not terrible. <laughs> Sure, I guess. Trade the the gate for a Phoenix. That's fine. Um, no, stop. Oh, dangerous territory when we put Unicorn on the field. All right, triggering the Torn Skate. <gasps> no, Nibiru. No, oh, we played into Nibiru. Dark Ruler, <laughs> Link Spider. Oh, so close yet so far away. All right, Keeper of Dragon Magic adds instant fusion, not branded fusion. Of course, yes, we're going to summon a Millennium Eyes Restrict, as you do, and pass. Yep, yeah, great. Awesome. Just wanted to keep that play safe from hand traps, which was go battle phase, you know. So, makes sense. All right, using uh, the right of Aramacer here. Not bad so far. Adding a spell and trap. Uh, adding Fog Blade. That's pretty good. Special the Aramacer into Mascarena. Normal Torn Scale into Bardish. Okay, okay, okay. Set Fog Blade. Set. Attack. Pass. Okay. Not bad. Fog Blade's pretty good here. Not when we use it on our cell. Oh my god. Okay, standby phase, double fog blade. Let's see if uh, Branded can out this. We got Alibur for opening into tragedy. <laughs> no Branded fusion, don't need it. Okay. <laughs> e Telly, that's huge. We got Zayaman. Okay, let's see. Aramacer. Uh huh. We're gonna add another. Uh, we're gonna add Shade Brigadine this time, triggering Torn Scale. Overlaying, not bad. Uh, break Sword here, but we negated our own Bardish, so you know. Fog blade pops the tragedy. You know, give your opponent the search there, sure. Uh, Aramacer is added. We're gonna make Dagda. <laughs> so we're gonna set up Scythe on turn six. As you know, that's the strongest turn for Despia. You don't wanna make sure that they do anything good there. So yeah, we've got the setup now. All right, uh, drawing a Cobra for turn. That's not good. Tragedy resets branded opening. Normal summons Co Scorpio. Uh, okay, there is the Scythe. Okay, can we trigger it? Special summoning a random Preda plant from the deck here. Nope, nothing really happening. Just clearing the board. Nice back and forth. Scythe, finally. Special summons. Locks him out of the extra in the end phase. Strong. Opening. Discard. Adding ad libitum. Okay. <laughs> now... No! Oh, your win condition! Oh, fog bleeding your own monster. Like, there's no way the bot can out this. All right, cleaning up the board a little bit here. We got a foxy tune in a dream. What, we, what have we got next? Normal summon Ash Blossom. I don't even have it. Why? That, why? <laughs> okay. Top deck e telly into Ziamen. Pass. <laughs> sure. Okay. Tribute summon Libitum. That has an effect. Also, did we just win without summoning a single fusion monster? By the way? <laughs> did, we, did, we, did we just win with Despia without using any fusions? Except, you know, the Millennium Eyes, which technically didn't do anything. Great. Despia is so strong. Check out my new TikTok account. Yes, I know. I, I, I hate it too. Where I upload some of the best moments of my channel. Follow me at Farfa Despair or click the link in the description. Next up, we've got Punk Therion versus Despia. I don't imagine Punk Therion setting up the combo with Calamities, I'm pretty sure, in this extra. Yeah, I, I really don't see him pulling off the combo with a bot, but we'll see. I'm going to go into Tupac here. Activate Foxy Chun. Oh no, we're just tribute somebody. <laughs> It's like the best card you could ask for, and you went Tribute Summon, okay. Uh, Alsa into Selene. Gonna negate that. Nope, too much power there. All right, Normal Summons. Baby, let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Turn one access, okay. Cross out on Allure. <laughs> sure. Here's Branded Fusion into Albion. What is Albion summoning? Lebellion. What's Lebellion summoning? Mirror Jade! Huge! Okay. Oh no. Oh nay! Oh nay! <laughs> oh, not like this. Access Pass was coming in clutch, dude. That's an Albion the Shrouded Dragon. Can we draw Branded Fusion? No, it's a set Mercurier. How unlucky. Popping the set card here. All right, all you need to do is go for game. Don't overcomplicate it. Easy, easy. There we go. <laughs> so snow is the worst card for bots, it looks like. All right, so unfortunately, we've drawn the Sunseed Twin. Not, not, not certain if that's what the detriment of this deck is, but we'll see. All right, we've got a Rite of Aramacer, not starting with Unexpected Die. Fateful Adventure adds Enchantress, discards to add another spell. Okay. Tribute summon drop. 
It's a vanilla. It's a vanilla monster. The synergy. Oh my... Out my bo Break my board. Driver with an equip pass. Let's go. Okay. Uh, noticing the threat of the ghost ogre on the field, decides to drop it away his uh, board. And... No, 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 no! Driver versus driver! <laughs> That's crazy. Sanguine, top decks, Ash Blossom. All right, you've got this. You've got this. Die. That's huge. Into Lokai. All right, let's do this. Okay, we're adding Enchantress. We're going to go into Thrasher. Pitching to add into uh, Arabacer. Uh-huh. Normal Summon Twin. Unicorn. Nibiru. <laughs> <It's> terrible. <laughs> that didn't help you. The, the Nibiru didn't help you. All right, we're going to go Huacero here. We got Snow Top Deck, Set Pass, okay. Uh, Huacero Special Summon, no effect. And we're going to use Fateful Adventure, adding Wandering Griffin. Battle Phase attacks over. And we're going to pass it up here. We are indeed. Top Deck's another Nibiru. End Phase, Huacero gets the Sanguine. All right, we're back into the Eldritch Engine. Here we go, Special Summoning, Golden Lord. And we're just going to go Fateful Adventure. <laughs> How many targets do we have? Discarding the Bloom, adding Enchant... Uh, right, Aramiser. Which uh, we can then use to special summon the Gryphon Rider. All right, big. We've got board presence and pressure. Is that going to be it? That is game. How did it find game? That's what I'm shocked of. Is that it managed to actually find find the winning play there. Not bad. All right, boys. Sword Soul versus BA. <laughs> my Raffle Copter goes swas, 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 swas. Oh my god, we drew Token Collector. <laughs> special Skarm. Normal Token Collector. BAs just don't work with bots, man. They just, it just doesn't work. Anyway, we got a shootout into Torrential. Long one effect, discard special summon. Trigger the token collector. Uh-huh, yeah, let's go. Into Ecclesia. Hey, you could have made a 10. Could have played around this. Shaman summon Moyi. Pass. Okay then, all right, draw for turn. We got normal summon backjack into Mascarena. Backjack effect stacks into Dynamicious. In phase, pass, okay, all right, all right. Backjack effect, hits a Fiend Griefing, not bad. Standby Fiend Griefing, dumping Torque. <laughs> yeah, that's not how that works. That's not, nah, that's not how that works, man. That's not what that does. <laughs> All right. Uh, here is... Every time we watch this, just a 10 -y deck. Have we even summoned a Synchro yet? I don't know, man. Okay. All right. Pass. BA has a dream here. Fiendish Rhino Warrior with a Dino Miscus. Okay. Sending Libich. You could have sent Graph. You could have sent Skarm. You sent Libich with no cards in hand. Why the BA no die, huh? And it looks like the Tenyi deck is victorious. Not much to it. Token Collector, no problem. All right. I am never putting BA in a bot tournament again. It's it's too easy. Here it is. Virtual World versus Punk Synchro. Right of Aramacer into Token for Fateful. So far, so good. Souls, not bad. Okay. Fateful Adventure. Uh-huh, adds the thing, draws a card into Dagda, but you already have the Scythe! Tribute Scythe- No, that's not what Scythe Lock means! That is not what we mean by Scything, people! That doesn't count, that's not the same thing! Oh my god! Ah, see, this is why Konami thinks this card shouldn't be banned. Hey, look, summon Scythe, well, it doesn't do anything, bro. Also, what the hell happened to your field? Sorry, is Scythe winning? Oh, no, Chuche. There we go, pop the Scythe. <laughs> yeah. Rose Dragon, ass. Oh, Zhuanwu, put it to defense, that's broken. Okay, normal Ash Blossom, battle phase, put it to defense. <laughs> what is it, Zhuanwu control? <laughs> dragon Dark, sorry, just Dark, that's why I think it's a dragon. Into Anima, Selene, okay, all right, making some plays here. Bring back a spellcaster, access code, all right, okay, not bad. Pops the Ash Blossom and pops the Ching Long. Of all cards, you pop Ching Long? My brother in Christ, what is going on? All right, here we go. Searching Lili and then immediately dumping it to the graveyard. Fantastic. And puts the Lili to defense with Zhuanwu. Nice. Okay, great. Normal summon Valor. Battle phase, Zhuanwu. Ogre the Zhuanwu, finally. <laughs> okay, problem has been dealt with. There's a GG top deck. Zhuanwu brings back Lili. And we have the Chuche here to pop the Veiler, overlay into Utopia Beyond, baby. This is cracked. Special summon GG, trigger Nyan Nyan. Okay, summoning a Juju. That's an Abiru, though. Ooh, 
not good. Why do they always put it in attack mode? Uh, what's that about, dude? All right, 24 over here. Top deck, what can we draw? Zayamin. Okay, Chuche. Standby phase. Pop the other Chuche. Fantastic. All right. I'm trying to give him a chance here. Okay, set pass. All right, don't mess this up. Stop Chuche popping your own... Oh, sorry, he's increasing the level. Never mind. Okay, some pressure has been mounted. Not bad. Top deck Enchantress. All right, what can we do with Enchantress? We've already used most of the Brave Engine turn one. Uh, we are just going to make a Shooting Riser. Okay. And it makes it level six and passes. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's a Dargon. Kowloon is activated for Qinglong, which we're going to use to negate Shooting Riser and then destroy the Shooting Riser. Huge combo, and that is going to be 5400 GG. Virtual World taking down the last game of round one. And we're off. Punk Therion versus Despia. I'm going to start off with a charge here, discarding Foom. Foxy Tune for Xiamen. Uh, should have been a deer note. Foxy Tune Tribute Summon. And Ziam. Oh, 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 amazing dragon. Bring back Foxy Tune. Set drop. I mean, this is. Seen worse. Seen worse. Ash Blossom's the branded opening. Doesn't hold for branded fusion. Branded fusion. Here it is. Albion into. Oh, you're playing this thing, the Starlight thing. Ah, droplet on the wrong monster. That's unlucky. Here is Alibur. Searching for branded scream. Or banishment, rather. Pass. Kind of top deck in here. Here's an Ogre Dancer. Sends it to tribute or summon it or something. Sharakusai. The, what? Uh, oh, God, you were so close, man. Okay, all right. Well, we're going to top deck into a disco. That's not awful, actually. Adding Lily and equipping. Okay, biggest monster on the field here. Not too bad. Adds another disco, though. Attacks over the uh, guy here. Uses the field spell, recycles the foom. Banishment, gonna use the effect here to fuse into Draco Stapelia. <laughs> Negating and reducing the level or something. Okay. Pass turn here. Draco Stapelia using its effect again. <laughs> Very cool. And by slip activates. Uh, brings itself back. Tragedy. Draco Stapelia punch. Uses the Therian Field spell. Okay. Therian Field spell gonna put in work now into an E-Telly top deck. E-Telly for Ziamen. Are we actually gonna do anything relevant with this? Probably not. No. Okay. We're gonna Therian Field spell for a Duke. Boom specials itself for the Lily Boria. Okay, now we're going to Ziyama. We've got Ogre Dancer. Sends itself to add another field spell. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, now we got Duke equipped here. All right, can you just... Like, whoa! Oh! Oh, the life points! Battle phase! Attack! Oh, no! It's not game! Woo! Okay, there's no way you're outing this. There is no way you're outing this. Keeper of Dragon Magic top deck. 8200 unaffected Punisher. How are you dealing with this? Special summoning the fusion material back in defense. Okay, great. Branded fusion for Albion. Banishing into Titanoclad. Okay, pass. <laughs> uh, you got it, my friend. Just don't do anything stupid. Don't do anything stupid. Just go battle phase and attack. Don't do anything stupid. You did something stupid. You, di you did something stupid. Okay, all right. Uh, still maybe have game here, though. Ah, you can't just play with your sauce right now. Can we just go battle phase? Uh, okay, that's unfortunate. We've cleared the board, but we decided to whiff game. The big board of Therion monsters, though. Not the biggest on the field, however. Using the effect to bounce away the, uh, the, the, the freaking Titanoclad. Okay, we've won the board now. Not too bad. Okay, fusing into Masquerena. Oh, sorry, Masquerade. Albion. Attack over. Don't think you're going to be able to activate any cards now. St Whoa, hang on a second. 300 life points. Let's chill here. Banishment? Oh, no. What are you doing? Into Quertalos. Bring back Draco Stapelia. Oh, that's it. What? Oh. Oh, nay. The oh, the tunnel, dude. The tunnel. You had this game in the bag. Wait, are you counter throwing? What's going on here? Okay, here we go. All right, GG. That was so close, man. So close. You, you almost had it. The Psychic End Punisher being using its own effect on itself. Not the way, man. Not the way. So it's was, 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 was versus, um, what did we say this was again? Yeah, this is plants. Okay. Special into Necrosynchron. Into Hulk. Gets Ash Blossom. That's not good. 
I promise you this is plants, by the way. This is definitely Sun... This is like Sun Avalon. I promise you. Uh, droplet in the standby on Hulk. Long one. Synchro? Are we gonna finally use a Synchro? Please summon a Synchro monster. Yes! Yazi! Not bad. Burn for 1200. Yazi. Pop. Okay. We're gonna go into Taya or Moye? Taya? Not bad. No! Nibiru! How? Wait, don't you still have your normal summon? Add back Ashuna. Ashuna, special summon into Monk. Normal summon Taya. Okay, here we go. Veiler, though. No. Unlucky. That's unlucky. You get the Veiler. All right. Big Nibiru on the field here. Top deck has Sewing. Special summoning Lokai into Healer to, for the tribute summon of Deer Note. Well, you know, I mean, I, I, I guess it's a, a Sun Avalon deck, sort of, kind of. I don't know. Ooh, Shaman's going to bring back Monk here. Ashuna will summon Shatana into another bo Dude, it just plays tangy control! This is not a sword soul deck! Okay, to be fair, it summoned one synchro. Stop making healer! Make dry ass! I think the AI realizes that dry ass doesn't have any attack points, so it's like, nah, this card has to be useless. Zero attack points? Can't be good. Painful decision. I'm not gonna use it? Okay. <laughs> sure, I guess. Uh, outing the Nibiru finally with a Shatana here. Top deck Moyi, normal summon. And we're gonna go into the battle phase. Critical damage now. Top deck and a dream. I mean, you have the combo. It's just the question is, are you going to do it? I... Do we know of any targets? Oh, you don't have any targets. No. <laughs> no targets. There's no seeds. All right, Chao Feng. Beautiful. Yep, GG. Sauce War taking it down, baby. Monkey Eldritch versus Virtual World. Let's see what we can do here. We got Black, which is going to be Ash. Then we're going to set four, baby. Oh, we're going to use Crow. Not terrible, I guess. Probably want to hold it for the Golden Lord, but okay. Rivalry, Skill Drain, Tikaboo, all in the standby phase. Let's go. Judgment Kowloon. Flip those trap cards. Don't use your brain. It's normal Summon Snow is... That's just going to be game, isn't it? Oh, top deck caliber. Smaller than snow, by the way. Snow beats over. You need to draw a monster, my friend. You need to draw a monster. Quakero is going to be able to chump lock this snow here. Standby phase. <gasps> Ghost Bell! It goes to the graveyard. Main phase. Battle phase. I was expecting a 30 turn, like, like slobber knocker. This is just like attack with snow pass. There's no virtual world cards needed. I mean, when you pay half your life points for a Kowloon, I, I guess that's what happens. Salaman Great versus Warsaw. Powered by Microsoft. <laughs> Special Ashuna. Not bad. Vishuda. Okay. Almost there. Summon Adara. <gasps> Synchro. No. Almost. Almost. So close. Oh, okay. All right. Adara, add back the Ashuna. We got Desires here, drawing into Normal Summon Ash Blossom. Beautiful. Okay, we got Blackout, though. That's insane. Tamagrade Circle is going to add Spinny. What are we going to Normal Summon? What are we Normal Summoning? We're going to Sign Up Mining Pitch Spinny. Chain Blackout Pop Sign Up Mining. Crazy. Wow. Didn't even pop the uh, Monk. Hits the Shaman. Triggers the Gazelle here. Dumps Jaguar. Goes into Bailing. Special Summon Spinny. So far, so good. Splash Mage. Bring back Jaguar into Heat Soul. Heat Soul Draw a Card. Normal Buffalo into access code. It's not terrible. It's not awful. Oh, uh, no, we ruined it. Access banish itself. All right. Uh, special summon a Shuna before the Moyi. Okay, that's probably not what I would have done, but all right, here we go. Uh, Pot of Desires. Is it just Shaman control again? It is indeed just Tenyi control. No synchros required. Very cool. All right, pass turn here. Can Salmon Great do anything? I mean, you've got a lot of good plays here. That's not the one. That's not the one. Buffalo, Pitch, Foxy, Trigger, Exceed. Oh, it would have been crazy, my friend. Still okay, though. I mean, not, not terrible position. Lingaribo. Just to trigger that Exceed. Okay. Uh, Baboska? No Baboska. Uh, don't even... Oh, Update Jammer for Transcode. Okay, that's something. Splash Mage, Revive, Exceed. And battle phase, attack and clear. It could have been worse. It could have been worse. All right, we've 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 won the board. How is Sorto going to clap back here? With a special summon of Ashuna, normal summon Moyi into Lina. 
yeah, not sure that was the play. Transcode, bring back Heat Soul. Heat Soul, draw a card. Ash it. I mean, why not? It's your last turn, probably. Normal summon Buffalo into Wolf. Oh, God, there goes the Heat Soul. Into another Wolf. Uh, adds back the circle for a Jaguar set and attack pass. Uh, should be game here, right? Adding a light monster. Ecclesia, okay. 23 directly. Main fit. Okay, right. One more turn. What could we do here? Rage in the standby to pop the own... Well, okay. Nope, no questions asked. Into Moyi. No, it's not Taya, you fool. You should have went into Taya. Maybe it doesn't even have Taya, to be fair. He did use Desires twice, admittedly. This has to be game, surely, right? Yep, there goes attack over the Moyi. 300, 2000, and GG. Salomon Great taking out Swoso. Wow. I'm actually surprised. Not really, I guess, if you're not going to use any of your synchros. Then that makes sense. Preda Despacito versus Swartzel. Branded opening here. Pitching opening for Alibur. Are we going to get fusion? We are going to get fusion. All right, pretty good. In the draw phase too. Playing around the draw. Smart bot. Always going for Albion, never Lebellion. Valor the Albion. Okay, normal summon keeper of dragon magic. Pitching for another branded fusion. Revealing the Albion and summoning Albaz in face down defense. Into contact Lenatus. Okay. <laughs> End phase sets a branded in red. I mean, it's not terrible. Oh, it is if you do it in the standby. Lebellion. Lebellion effect. We're going to go Mirror Jade. Titanoclad. <laughs> okay. Uh, Adara for Monk. Special summoning with the Ashuna for another Adara. It's a double Monk. Adding back the Ashuna. And special summon the Ashuna for Shaman. Can we please just make a Synchro, man? <laughs> just please just summon a Synchro monster. <laughs> Token, come on! Finally, a synchro monster! It's a Tenyi, of course. Berserker, attack over, effect, gain, clear the Titanic clan! Oh my god! Bro, Sword Soul popping off with the Tenyi cards, let's go! Alright, uh, end phase does get the branded fusion back here, so we can clap back a little bit. Do you have the brains to do it though? That's the thing. Branded fusion for Albion. Albion banish. Chain the Berserker, doesn't matter. We've got uh, Mirror Jade. Bring back Albion, Mirror Jade effect, banishing a monk instead of the Tenyi. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. We're clapping back, we're establishing the board. Let's see what we can do from here. Forbidden Droplet, no! <laughs> All you had to do was attack Oliver! Cross out the instant fusion. Just, no questions asked, dude. Oh, we just Mirror Jade banished himself. <laughs> like, who can throw the hardest? And we're back to a simplified game state. 18 defense, 18 attack. What can you do? All right, we're waiting it out, I suppose. Who can out top deck each other? That's a Moyi. No cards in hand, though. Oh, Yazi! I didn't even see that play. Genius! Okay, hit the back row first for Vashuda. Uh, not the play I would have done. Okay, here we go. Uh, puts it in defense mode. Imperm as well. Here's another Moyi. Oh, normal summon Valor into a Synchro. Boxia, let's go. All right. Unfortunately, we've got Imperm. Uh, so we can still go battle phase here. Clear the Alibur. Mo uh, doing this under five summons too. Not bad. There's a top deck Ash Blossom. Not great. We're going to draw a Worm. No Worm drawn here. Okay, Boxia popping itself for Ecclesia. That's summon number one. Into Taya, summon number two. Don't like this. Token, summon number three. Ashuna, summon... Yeah, no, this is not going well. Into Baxia, spinning the Alibur, chain Nibiru. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Uh, fortunately for us, the token's still really big, though. Bouncing back the Nibiru, 41-17. That's going to be game, ladies and gentlemen. Sword Soul taking it down. <laughs> Playing into Nibiru is fine, as long as your token is bigger. All right, top four match, numero dos. Salaman Great versus Virtual World. Okay, gonna start with the sign up mining, pitching the uh, Moonlit Chill, which is gonna be DD Crote after. O okay, sure. Linger Rebo Pass. Tends to be the standard play for uh, Salomon Great for some reason, but okay. Normal GG. We've got Lao Lao. All right, dumping a trap here. Lulu Effect. What are we gonna search? That's what I wanna know. Truche. Okay, it's not awful. Uh, Stardust Charge. Draw. Bring back GG here. Nibiru. Big token. Always in attack mode for some reason. 3,900. Punches over. And pass. Still got a good hand here, though. Chuche flipped in the standby. Don't pop itself. No! What are you doing? Desire is after... Oh, I just... I have so many questions right now, man. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's just a hard throw. 
Okay, here's Lao Lao. Bring back Lao Lao for Ching Long. Overlay into. Is that Utopia Beyond? No, oh, that's M7. Negating his own M7. Chuchi popping his own M7. Asserting dominance, I see. Punching over the spinny and passing. All right. Set Gazelle! You had like 10 plays there. And that was the one that wasn't correct. Punches over Gazelle. All right, draw for turn here. Zhuan Wu. Oh, God, please, not the Zhuan Wu shuffle. I hate the Zhuan Wu shuffle. Put it to attack. Put it to defense. Put it to attack. Put it to defense. Stop! Why? <laughs> Why? All right, still not making any plays with Salomon Great, it looks like. Normal summon snow. Negating the snow with Ching Long. Zhuan Wu shuffle. Yep, put the monster in defense for no reason. Why would we try and, you know, win the game? Uh, normal summon Moonlight into Almirage, triggering the Exceed. Okay. Oh, that's a Almor that's a Imperm. That's unlucky. Protects the set card from destruction with the Almirage. Flip summon the Jaguar. Brings back the Spinny into Sunlight Wolf. Okay, kind of popping off here. Jaguar triggering the Wolf. Returning a monster. Circle is negated in the Imperm column. <laughs> Even the bot plays into the Imperm column. Uh, Heat Soul draw Rage. Splash Mage for Transcode. Transcode revive Heat Soul. Access code. Here we go. We're doing it. We're doing it. Access. No, he banished itself. You could have banished literally anything else, man. Oh, that's so unfortunate. All right. Chuche is going to pop his own snow. And then we're going to snow our own field and attack. At least the Juan Wu is gone, honestly. Are we going to deck out, by the way? We desire twice, just saying. Juan Wu popping itself. Okay. Sets an Ash Blossom. Top decks DD Crow. Hits the Exceed. Why? I don't know. Playing around Avarice or something. Uh, Zhuan Wu negating his own snow. Punch over the Ash Blossom. Draw for turn. It's a Gazelle. Wait, you have a Gazelle in deck? Okay, we're going to Rage Pop the snow here. Salad is kind of winning, but it's also like losing to deck out. So, you know, I think Desires is kind of wrecking you right now. Sign up Mining. Probably don't even have any targets left for that. Yeah. Uh, there's a GG. We just have to Normal Summon. Don't do anything fancy here. Ladies and gentlemen, virtual... Oh, I can't count. Never mind. One more turn. Last card in deck is Moonlight Chill. Pass. Nope, that's unlucky. All right. Uh, 18 defense. Is that going to be enough? Are we going to attack with snow first? That's the question. Increasing the level. Going to go for a rank through... Uh, no, we can't overlay into anything, actually. Salmon Great. Through. Virtual World through. And I guess the question is who threw the least. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a final of... Preda Despia, I think? No, Virtual versus Sword Soul. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. Here we go. Grand final is Wolf, 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 Wolf versus Virtual World. This is what it all comes down to. Who is the strongest bot deck? Norm, activate to add Moyi. DD Crow the, the Emergence. Great. Gotta play around it, you know? Special Adara. Normal Adara. Into Monk. Into Sham. <laughs> Stop. Bring back a Monk. Go into... Oh, God, you had... Oh, just doesn't want to use the freaking synchros. All right, we're going to E-Telly for Lulu. Uh, then we're going to put GG face up. Uh, sorry, Zhuanwu, then summon GG, and then go for a Juju synchro summon. Okay. Well, um, that's probably better than what Sword Souls managed to establish here. Level 9 synchro Shen Shen. Not bad. Put into defense for some reason. Pass. Adding Tauti. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, pitching Mo Yi to bring back Adara. Why? No one knows. Puts the Adara to attack mode. He wants to hit it for really big damage, I suppose. Blackout, though. Hitting the Shaman. Why the Shaman? That's your resource. Negating the Adara. Passing. Okay, here we go. Shatana. This is just Tenny control. <laughs> this is Tenny control. <laughs> Attacks directly here, and we need some virtual monsters to put onto the board. The Lala would be insane. Nope, that is a triple talent. Not gonna get us anywhere here. Oh, we still got the Shen Shen, however. Yeah, that comes back now and then puts it to defense, I guess, to protect him. You know, why not? Top decking into Ecclesia. Good draw here. Are we gonna summon Taya? Summon Mo Long One. Oh, big brain. Yazi. Oh, I'm liking it, dude. Okay. Uh, okay, we should have went Taya here, but it is what it is. You know, it could have been worse. Puts the Vashuda into attack mode? What? <laughs> I want to take more damage, Giga Chad. There's Lao Lao. Okay, we can do some walling up here. That's not terrible. Uh, Lao Lao gonna be able to revive Shen Shen? Uh, can't you just use Shen Shen's normal effect here? 
Tribute summon long one. Okay, puts the Fashuda into attack mode. No more monks to link away to bounce here. And top decks into e Telly for Nyan Nyan. Anything here? King Long banish onto a Synchro 9 for Vermilion Dragon Mech. Has the Imperm. Sorry, that's not Vermilion Dragon Mech. That's the uh, Navy Dragon Mech. I don't actually know what it does, but an Imperm, so who cares? Attack and pass. All right. Top deck Dragon Circle. Pitching to add Long One. <laughs> that's the wrong Swordsoul, my friend. That's the wrong Swordsoul. Puts a long one on defense mode here. Ching Long to negate. Juan Wu puts his own guy back to a defense mode after putting it in attack mode. And punches over the long one here. And draw for turn. Long one. Third long one. Okay, just one level 10 synchro. Anything. Vishuda, that's huge. Dragon circle to add a Shuna. Okay, we're doing more plays here. Special summon into Vishuda. Synchro into Qixing. Okay, that's huge. Put it to defense mode though. That's not really great. Oh, chains to banish, however. <gasps> That's game! Oh, Kishin coming in clutch! Banishing the Zhuan Wu shuffle. Finally, it turns out if you summon a Synchro Monster in Sword Soul, you can actually win. And Sword Soul takes down the whole tournament. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I really appreciate you sticking out to the end. If you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to Zeke, which I will leave a, uh, a link in the description to down below. So please uh, check out his YouTube channel and give him a follow. He set this up and put all of the matches together. So without him, this wouldn't be possible. Please consider using the sponsor for today. And until next time, adios.